Fuck me. Just to let everyone know, there's a delay. So obviously, you're gonna see Tramit jump and then me jump. <laughs> and the noise at a later time. Just to let everyone know in the stream. What the fuck, oh, man? That was a bad one. Yeah. My heart's still pounding, bro. <laughs> um. Oh, it's a blood trail, eh? And then squeaky voices at the back of the... Uh, give me good ones, you know. The boogie man. Which one is it? Hmm. 90 years. I was born in 90 years. Stop pushing your nose, man. What the fuck, man? Flashlight when you need it. Don't touch me. <laughs> <laughs> that baby <made me> jump. <laughs> <laughs>
park is a collage of contradictions all of its own. Millions of people die every year in car crashes. Casually the park has little about cars about designed again. specifically to simulate that action. Hear the children scream with joy. In the sideshow alley, you can walk away with 15 cents worth of mass-produced Chinese teddy bears, while a grinning carny pockets your hard-earned five dollars. What secrets lie beneath the sullen waters of the lake? The tears of jilted lovers, the soiled condoms of illicit affairs, the clotted blood of the lonely suicide. And the face of the witch looms over it all. I always despised her toothy grin and warty nose. I hate that sparkle in her weathered, watchful eyes. I think Callum is waiting for me inside. Where did you find this game? <laughs> PlayStation Store horror games. <laughs> there we go, got a flashlight now. House of Not Horror. Not a very bright one, is it? Not really. Is this a house of horrors? Oh no. Uh, it's a horror game and now it's putting you in a horror house. It's, it's never good. <laughs> Scary, bro. It's like the worst flashlight I've ever seen. So it's not even a light.
<laughs> I think that's where you came. I'm talking from like, I'm behind. Oh shit. That does not right. Just jumped again, man. I don't want to know what it was. to that basement. Nice book. Very nice. I like. Excuse me. So I press the buttons to the ground. For the kidney. Buzzing. After they let me out, they gave me Callum back and sent me home with a handful of breadcrumbs. Home bit a sweet home. I barely recognized it. Where there had been color and light, there were shadows and regrets. Where there had been warmth, there was a bone deep coldness that never went away. I tried my hardest to keep the ghosts at bay. Don, watching from the dusty corners while I tried to teach his son to read. My father, coldly assessing me and finding me lacking. I devoted myself to Callum and did the things that they told me. It will get better, they said. Every day will be a little better than the last. I'm in the woods now. Lost and afraid. Things never got any better. Well, at least you know Cameron. Cameron? <laughs> Cameron, yeah. <laughs> 